This is not the right decision. Go to bed, Caleb. It's 2.30 in the morning. You have work tomorrow. What are you doing, Caleb? Go to bed. So I'm gonna start making these new segments, I guess, on my channel. I don't know if this is gonna be a regular thing, but uh, probably, because I have unneeded opinions about a lot of things. Actually, it's false. I have opinions on nothing, yet I, I, I don't know. Anyway, so no one asked for this, but here's my opinion on recently, as in like Monday or yesterday, or yesterday was Monday. The US Embassy of Seoul posted some something. It was like, congratulations to Busan for their first, um, Pride Festival, I guess, LGBT Pride Festival. And I saw a lot of people that were in the camp of, yay, congratulations, and then a lot of people that were in the camp of like, boo, this is terrible, you know, like, the either or, of course, both sides. And <laughs> I have opinions. They're not helpful opinions, and they are definitely contradictory, but I have opinions. I am plagued by forever playing devil's So I am plagued f by forever So I am plagued by <laughs> So I am plagued by forever playing devil's advocate, and I always see both sides of every situation, which makes me not have very strong opinions about anything, and I'm always just like, and too incredibly like empathetic, I guess, to my own detriment. I'm great fun at political rallies. I'm gonna start by defending the positive people in this. Oh, that makes me sound like I'm taking a side. I'm gonna stand by the people that are thinking positively about this situation. So I can definitely understand why people are in support of this. I also, I guess, am in support of it. I think it's great that um, Seoul is finally opening up uh, socially, and I know that this isn't, like, it's the U.S. Embassy posting it, so I guess it's the U.S.'s opinion, but it's the U.S. Embassy in Seoul, and like, <laughs> so this, this point might not even be valid whatsoever. I don't I just think that Korea is slowly making, like, progression towards um, acceptance towards LGBT, which I think is great. Not everyone does, and that's fine, but I think it's great. So lots of people were in the camp of, yay, this is great, congratulations to Busan for finally having their own first, because I know Seoul have had a few, and I went to the one this year, I made a video about it, you can watch it. I'm not gonna tag it, so you can, if you really wanna watch it, you'll go find it. It really wasn't that long ago, so you can find it. So some people are happy, yay, congratulations. Then there are people that are not happy. <laughs> the part where I defend these people too. Totally unasked for and unneeded opinion, but I'm giving it. There are, I've seen like, I was, I was like fishing through the comments, I saw like two main reasons why people were upset about this. The first one being like a cultural thing. Korean society contradicts America's society and that in America, like parades like these are, I guess, a little easier to um, facilitate because, you know, often at like pride events or something like that, there might be like things that aren't necessarily child friendly. I mean, they're not like out there like having like public orgies or whatever, but you know, like things that you wouldn't see on a, <laughs> you wouldn't see in a church service. I can say that. And in America, I guess it's a little like what, at least what some of the people were saying is that it might be a little easier to do that because uh, America is so like, Big parades like this can happen on like sanctioned off streets where like you're not gonna be seeing the parade unless you're wanting to see it. And then some people were saying that like uh, in Korea it's more of a everyone's open society so like since it's such a small country there's more children to adults in the same vicinity ratio than there is in America so like more young people are like open to seeing things at these pride events, which then of course opens up the discussion. So of course, that's a great thing. And then some people are gonna say, no, it's not. And yeah. So that's the one side of people that don't like this that I can see. The other side of it, the people that don't like it, of course, is for religious regions. Re regions? Oh my God. Okay. <laughs> uh, I come from a religious family and I still consider myself to have a faith. I know a lot of people and my family would disagree because I don't do things a certain way. For all intents and purposes, I personally call myself a Christian because I believe in God. However, I know not everyone has the same opinion and that's fine. That's not the direction this video is going though. I know a lot of Christians were getting upset because obviously it's like homosexuality is against uh, Christianity. So then of course the Christians are defending, you know, like the Bible says this and this and this and this is why it's wrong and then the non-Christian people were of course getting offended by this by like, God says you need to love all. Why are you discriminating and hating on gays because they're not part of your religion? And I, this, <laughs> that's all, that's all honestly I can say. I was, I'm so conflicted on this because since I come from a religious background, I know very well the inside opinions about why Christians think a lot of things. Even if I don't agree with them, I know why they think them. I know from a Christian perspective, or at least Christian from the perspective that I was raised in it as, does that make sense? It's not that Christians 
hate gays. <laughs> I mean, some do, yes, but not always. And a lot of times that's not the case, Like, for, but for Christians, equating love and acceptance are not on the same path. Like, you can love without accepting, at least. That's how some people would see it, which, again, I don't know if I agree with, but that's, that's how it's seen a lot of times. So that's why, like, a lot of Christians would say, I can love a gay, but I can't condone their behavior, and that's why I don't agree with pride events and such and such. And so that's why whenever people, non-Christians, are saying, like, God says to love all, so, like, why aren't you accepting this pride parade and letting it happen and quit being, like, discriminatory? I just can't fully get behind, and I know that, like, it's valid in some ways, and then it's also not valid in some ways, and the Christian perspective is valid in some ways, and it's not valid in some ways, and just the whole, ugh, oh, God, ugh. This is why I have n not opinions about things, because I can see both sides, like, too well, and I'm, like, the forever empathist. <laughs> and it doesn't get me anywhere. <laughs> I don't know what else I need to say about this. Is there a resolution to this video? I don't think so. I've just tossed around the thoughts of my brain and released them into the ether. Uh, yeah. I really don't think there's anything else. So, um, I really need to go to bed because this is stupid and I shouldn't have made this. But it's made, so I'm gonna put it in the internet. I'm gonna, but I'm gonna, uh, I'm tired. <sighs> I'm going to bed. Okay, bye. <laughs> Just another aside from later me that is editing this right now. I know I'm gonna get dragged from every angle of every community for not representing things 100% properly. LGBT community is gonna be like, that's not what we're about. The Korean community is gonna be like, that's not what we're about. The Christian community, particularly, I know some people in my family are gonna be like, that's not what we're about and you're representing us incorrectly. Ah! <laughs> I'm doing my best, and also I didn't plan out this video before I filmed it, so everything I said was ad libbed, and I'm not ever gonna say, and I'm not ever gonna say everything perfectly, and I apologize for that. And this this can turn into a whole other video, so that I'm gonna save the rest of this. But take my thoughts with a grain of salt, or the entire shaker, and uh, see you guys next time. Bye. Literally no one asked for this, like this is why I might- why? <laughs>